so hi guys and welcome back to the sensational lifestyle by Heidi so for today we will be talking about the incoming ongoing and new release product and perfume review so without a further ado let's just move on so hi everyone and welcome back so for today we will be talking about this very long time perfume that I have it with me this was launched on 2007 yes it is this is the salvatore Bergamo in canto shine i saw this perfume with my friend and from the time that i smell it i was just tell her i wanted to buy that not to copy but i was captured by the perfume and by the sense of the perfume it's very a uh, happy feeling ladies and gentlemen this is the first thing that i will tell you and i keep it the box because i'm a box hoarder and i already told you that when you have your box and keep it your bottle in the box it helps for the perfume to evaporate and to maintain the note itself uh, of the perfume so so just jump ahead with the bottle itself and look how colorful is that very shiny very transparent but it has a variations of different type of color itself i like the transparency i have no clue what behind with the bottles history i tried to research and i cannot find out why but i'm sure that it has a history why the perfumer designed this type of bottle this um i love it very very the juices itself she's very nice right guys very beautiful type of perfume that i love it it's just like for me every time i see this and every time it uplifts me so let's just talk about the top notes with this beautiful perfume which is a pineapple passion fruit bergamot. So the middle note with itself is like a fresh up peach pink peony ladies. So the base note it is amber mass and southern. So I found that this bottle is like for me in my own opinion this is a type of bottle that is a very calm um, temporary type it's just like a carefree because it doesn't have a type of pattern that the perfumery made it it's just like okay whatever is itself I will make it this type of bottle with the carefree that represent the summer colorful motif itself so I hope you will react with that things i will not sure but yes that's how i can um describe this type of bottle for me it's just like wow it's always wow i i always i don't know why but that's the side effect of this type of perfume to me this is a very fruity floral scent with the opening of singing singing means just like it's hit me with this type of perfume it sings to my vein because that's a true with the opening of really freshly pineapple and fashion fruits ladies mm. pineapple is one of my favorite favorite per, uh, perfume fruits at the same time pineapple and fashion passion fruits i always bought that when i was a kid i remember my my grandmother always bought that and my brother and some of my cousins hate it because it's very sour while i'm eating it with this very red juicy liquid of that fruit um even here in australia when there's a passion fruit i love it especially with the yogurt itself oh man oh that's what i can say oh it's just like oh it's a resemblance of victoria's secret victoria's secret it's a little bit bit fruity itself in the floral but the victoria itself is seductive type of perfume while this pergamon kata is a very pretty type of floral um it's really refreshing itself it's peak the name it is like in kanto it means it is a charm or enchantment it's just like you have a charming while you are spraying this while you are wearing this and it is it is it's a very strong pineapple and very strong passion fruit and then when 
for me it's just like a brightly charming type of perfume that I would love to have it for a lifetime this is the one that I wanted to keep it for long since I found this from my friend and I always repurchase repurchase once I found that they have it here in Australia bought it I bought it I spray it the whole day at work I don't care whatever people would just say I'm too strong I mean I'm not too strong I'm my perfume is too strong I don't mind but it's a happy feeling for me every time that one of my perfume I smell it that I have it also I this is a two type of perfume that when I feel sad I spray it the vulgar one yeah the Omnia Amethyst is the one that I have it that every time I am in a sad mode I spray that and this one because it's giving me this feeling and mood that it makes me uplifting happy carefree that I want to indulge my life what is in besides me the hook of this clothes yes right ladies this is a perfect type sometimes that's our problem with our dress we haven't even noticed that this one that they made this I don't get the point or the scientific explanations of this little hook there with a lot of note of this type of perfume that makes it in the this very very wonderful and gorgeous Encanto this is say as a magical sense to me it makes me smile the type of perfume that like this it makes me always smile it's really well balanced between the fruity and the floral itself um, this is good perfume if you are at home, if you are in, as I said, if you're in the bad mood, um, if you're with your children in the park, also in the shopping center, and if you wanted to go out just with your friends for the lunch time, this is perfect because first, especially in the humid um, place, that's why when I have this, it will balance because of the humidity. It's very light, soft, at the same time, it's fruity. It's very summery, humidity, holiday type of perfume at the same time. Perfect. Perfect itself that I do like. So this is the only thing that, that the people can wear this between teenager to adulthood. Can wear this. Very versatile. I think 40, 50 years old can wear this because this is a type of perfume that can adopt. It's very adaptable to any type of persons or any type of age of the persons. That's very adaptable. It's very perfectly smoothly sense everyone. Um, I wanted to know and hear who's the people who love this. I wanted to know and if you can share your experience with this type of perfume. What is your opinion about this type of perfume? Let me know, ladies and gentlemen. I can recommend this for summer, especially if it's hot. Spring, good also. But most of the time, it's the summer. I will be recommended this type of perfume for summer. Um, silage is 2 to 3 meters. It's good enough that the people will um, notice you and smell you. This is very nice type of perfume. I got a lot of compliment with this at work, even outside at work. There's a type of people that asking me which type of perfume it is. And it's really cheap, not that expensive, but the longevity itself is very worth a penny. Five hours is good enough this is good for you ladies and gentlemen if you want it to be um what do you call this if you want it to be noticed in a different way in a happy feeling way perfect and this is good for a gift for the young women young adult women and young women out there and the secondary people teenager can wear this perfect 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 that's what I can say and there's only things that I can say with this type of perfume Ferragamo try it you won't regret it ladies and gentlemen so that's for all guys so if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and click the button down there so you will be notified to every Saturday Sunday and Monday video upload and if you enjoy this type of review please don't forget to click comment 
and share this with your friends and family and i hope i see you guys the next video and have a great wonderful day bye for now guys and see ya